Hello, everyone. Oh, let me take the lens off. Okay, there you go. Hello again. Coming. This is your host, Brujo underscore Anthony87. Coming to you live from my bedroom in East Los Angeles. In Southern California. In the, in the San Gabriel Valley. Um... <clears throat> I wanted to share, uh, this is my little prayer book, or I guess my book in general, dedicated to Santa Muerte. Um, I might make a bigger version of this, but this is like to get the bases down because in my uh, personal book of shadows, or I shouldn't call it book of shadows, it's more like a grimoire. Um, it's too disorganized right now and it's not uh, it's everything's in there so this one's just solely dedicated to Santisma Muerte um I have some sketches in there but I'm like now I want to make them more into paintings and then who knows maybe in the future I'll make a book my version of my devotion to her uh inspired by, by my teachers and whatnot um so uh, the personada right and right there those of you who are of, uh, who are catholic you're aware of what the personada is um then i have some sketches which i might elaborate on she's been coming to me now with um kind of how like you see how the hindu um pantheon comes with like the multi um numbered arms um so I might combine elements of that. That might be a new interesting image. Um, anyway, um, so I have the Apostles' Creed, the Our Father with the Mexicoto symbol right there, and then with the Hail Mary with um, Tonatzingo at Liquez, um image on the side right there, then the Glory B, the Psalm 23. This might be a painting that I might make. This is just a big, it's not my greatest work, but this is like a sketch. And then I have her litany, um, her rosary. And uh, let me see what else do I have in here. Her uh, novena. It's nothing fancy in there. It's just writing. <laughs> but I wanted to share this prayer for you. It's my version of a prayer that's combined with um, a, a couple, uh, a, a teacher of mine. Her name's Concha. Uh, she teaches uh, courses um, about curanderismo, about crystal healing, brujeria in general, um, crystals, uh, holistic um, healing, um, she has a Santa Muerte course, if you guys are interested. Um, I don't know if she's doing it right now. I know last time she was fixing up her page. I don't know, honestly, if she's gonna, I hope she brings it back up because I'm curious to take it. Anything to learn more better about Santisma Muerte. Um, I have my altar back here too. So I don't know if you could see it. There you go my altar to her right there and I just wanted to share it to you as a prayer going out towards you so if you see this video it was meant to happen and um, I had written this daily prayer to her way when I started my devotion to her now I have expanded it and I, I edited it out and added some things this is my prayer for everything for her and um if you, if this inspires you to incorporate into your own practice, um, or you just need that little, need a little kick and blessings, then reach out your hands to the screen. Reach out your hands to the screen and I'll send over the transmission. Mm-hmm. <laughs>
by the sign of the Holy Cross, delivers from our enemies. O oh Lord, O oh God, through the power and the intercession of la Nuestra Santísima of Muerte, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. La Nuestra Santísima Muerte, I come to you with humility. Shower your infinite mercy and blessings towards my prayers. With the power of your holy mantle, cover and rub us and my loved ones with your warm and loving embrace. Protect me and my loved ones from enemies, witchcraft, evil spirits, bad luck, the evil eye, grief, negative energies, and from all unforeseen dangers and accidents. Grant us good health in body, mind, and spirit. Heal us in times of illnesses with the medicine that we need to ensure good health. Use your holy scales to bring peace, love, happiness, and prosperity into our homes. Grant us luck and success in all of our goals. Tip the scales of justice in our favor. When we are wronged by those who wish us harm or those who betray us. Grant us liberty, freedom, and justice. Restore the balance in our lives and bring us in alignment to our true purpose and bring us closer to our higher selves. Send forth your holy companion, the Lachusa, to set us on the path of set us on the path of enlightenment, wisdom, and knowledge. Teach us your spiritual strength and goodness. Teach us your wisdom and your secrets. Instruct us in ability and knowledge in our chosen paths. Work through our mind, body, and souls so that through you we may help those who are in need. Guide us through the path of truth and illuminate us always in the divine direction. Give us the dignity to reach supreme blessing. We invoke your, sac we invoke your assistance in this sacred moment so that you will fortify us with your divine fluids. Guide us to comprehend the love of our creator towards us. Help us to make good and wise decisions every day. Lead our thoughts always towards goodness and protect us from the influences of those who tempt us to stray. Help us to evolve into a higher state of consciousness. Support us on our path in each day's decisions. Help us to have the strength to resist spirits that could induce us to error. Illuminate our thoughts. And remove the veil of ignorance from our eyes so that we may recognize our faults. Help us to improve our lives as we become closer to divinity. With the power of your holy scythe, cut and remove all obstacles, bad luck, and negative energies that stand in our way, and fill, our, and fill, a, fill it instead with good luck and success in all of our endeavors, and help us to open up our roads. Through the great power which God has given to you, I ask you, we ask you to hear all of our prayers and grant us all the favors we ask for until the last day, hour, and moment when the Divine Majesty shall call us before His Divine Presence. La nuestra Santísima Muerte, beloved of our hearts, do not abandon us without your protection. Use our powers on our behalf and never forsake us. Oh, blessed mother of all.
in you we trust and confide in everything. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. That's all I wanted to share. Um, I'll make another one in a little bit. Not too sure what about. Let me see if there's anything in here that I could share. The Novena. No. Uh, I think that will be it for now. Um, I think this week I'll either make a video on how to make a spiritual bass because I always... Um, in readings, or when I do them on Facebook in public, um, I uh, there's oftentimes where I recommend a spiritual bath. Um, and there's just a couple of ways, and I just feel it's more easier to show it than to type it out and explain it. Um, so let's say tomorrow we'll do a cleansing uh, bath using fresh rose petals that I could find in my uh, local neighborhood for free. <laughs> And um, that will be it. I will talk. see you soon. As always, take care. Be safe. Be kind to yourself. And be kind towards each other. I love you all. If, you, um, if you'd like to subscribe to my channel, subscribe. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or concerns or recommendations, um, type in in the comments below if you have any questions pm me you can find me on um facebook under brojo underscore anthony 87 or you just type in my name anthony casillas that's c-a-s-i-l-l-a-s -L -L and you can find me on tiktok and instagram brujo underscore anthony 87 i'm your host brujo anthony Love you all and have a good night.